not be ideal to do this outside, but I got my Infinity camera today from High Point Scientific, and I can't wait to open it. So here goes. I was actually surprised to get it so soon after I ordered it. And of course, the skies tonight are not going to be ideal for taking my uh, telescope out. But hopefully, fri by Friday, they will be better. So here goes. Package full of peanuts. And here it is. The A-Tech Infinity Camera. Of course, I'm probably bungling the name terribly, but <clears throat> I have been looking forward to this for a long time. So, what's in here? Well, you got the packing list. That's nice. You, got, you actually have a manual. Not everything is uh, on CD these days or electronic or have to be downloaded. Although, I will say that before I got the camera, I did go on the... Uh, ATIC site and I downloaded the latest version of the software and when you install that it also installs the manual so they actually recommend that you go ahead and do that and not use the uh, installation on the CD just to make sure you get the latest version so but it is nice to actually get a, uh, a manual um, in writing because I tend to make notes on things and uh, Either they have to provide it or I have to print it out. So, and it, it looks like it's a pretty good manual. Um, it's got some good illustrations and uh, uh, explanations of the software, which is really helpful. Um, so that looks good. Of course, it comes with the DVD, I guess. CD, DVD. Um, Okay, let's look what else, some nice foam. Oh, the other thing that I did do in advance is I went ahead and got a, um, a photographer's bag uh, to keep this in. So um, I can just sling it over my shoulder and take it with me when I set up my uh, telescope. So that's another little handy thing that you might want to either order when you order the camera or order in advance. Um, of ordering the camera just so you have it when it arrives. And here da -da -da, is the camera. And actually it's a little heavier than I expected. Um, a plastic bag. There's the back. Well, I guess it depends on what <laughs> Which, which you think is the back and which you think is the front. Um, there's the other side. How's that? Um, it looks pretty well built. It's got a, it looks like a Cat5 um, port and uh, power and the USB for the cable. Um, it's got... For power, um, it's got nicely sealed. Um, a 12 volt cigarette lighter, um, electrical power, and the USB cable. Let's take a look at that just to sort of get a feel for how. Oh, it looks pretty long. So you, you have uh, quite a ways to uh, string it to get to your laptop. That's the other thing is that um, you can get an electrical, regular standard um, electrical uh, cable for this to plug it into a power source. Um, but I actually prefer the cigarette lighter alternative uh, because I, again, in advance, I went ahead and, and got one of those um, uh, jump start battery contraptions. Because um, I figured not only <laughs> will it be useful to have in my car if I need a jump start, but it'll run this pretty well. So uh, I went ahead and did that in advance. And that's pretty much what you get in the box. 
Um, so you've got your USB cable, you've got your power source, or sorry, power cable, and you've got your, your camera. And uh, I'm hoping to have clear skies here in North Carolina sometime maybe uh, this weekend, and I'll give it a shot, and when I do, I'll go ahead and post it online. So I hope this helps somebody, and thanks.